Greetings, freshmen of Jericho Hall. It's been over a month now since academics have started, and many of you have had the opportunity of making new friends. But as this quarter comes to an end, you will find yourself with opportunities of proving your friendship by holding your friends accountable. Now, you might wonder what I mean by this. Uh, so let me give you an example. When I was a senior in high school, I had to write a 6,000 word thesis in order to graduate. But the weekend before the thesis was due, I still had to write 4,000 words while most of my classmates were already done with the rough draft. And to make things worse, I had a state lacrosse trip that involved 15 hours of driving. Well, the morning of the trip, I showed up to the bus bright and early, and I saved one of the nicest seats in the back of the bus with a lot of leg space. But unfortunately, my friend, Alex, had already reserved that seat. So when he arrived, he demanded that I give, give it back to him. But I told him that I needed it because I had a lot of work to do, and I thought that the seat would at least help me to focus. Well, after I pleaded with him for a while, he finally consented, but he said that he would let me have the seat on one condition. As long as I was getting work done, he would let me sit there. Now, even though I had planned on getting work done during the trip, I can promise you that I wouldn't have written a single word if it wasn't for Alex. You see, Alex set timers every 45 minutes and threatened to actually take my seat away if I didn't complete 200 words by the end of each timer. Now, by the end of the bus ride, I had doubled my word count. And it, the only reason I was able to turn in my thesis on time is because Alex had helped me. Not gonna lie, at the time, I was actually kind of annoyed with Alex. But looking back, I can see that Alex was actually being a faithful friend. While other friends of mine just wanted to chat and hang out, Alex was actually holding me accountable. That's what a faithful friend does. And this is the type of true friendship that I would urge you to strive towards. Thanks for hearing me out, and I'll see you all later.